Welcome back everybody. It's your boy T and we have a new video. So real quick, let me <clears throat> let me say I'm not going to post videos every time that I do a load cuz some of the loads that I do is the same material. It's, it's the same thing over and over and over. So I'm not going to put a put out a video every time that I do a load because like I said it's the same stuff, you know, because, yeah, it's hot shot, it's something, I wouldn't say, like, a unique job, but it's still a job, you know, except you just, you're just hot shotting, truck driving with a pickup and a flatbed, but, <clears throat> like I said, it's the same, it's the same thing, it's a regular job, so, again, I'm not going to post a video of every load that I do. I post loads or videos of loads that are pretty, I mean, that are different and cool. And, I, you know, I'll show you all some of that stuff, but I'm not going to just post videos to post videos. I'll post videos, you know, on some helpful tips and tricks that I think that may help y'all. But, you know, I, I'm not going to post videos all the time. When I do, then I do, but, but yeah. So... This video that I'm going to show you, or this load that I'm going to show you, first let me say it has no sound. I mean, it has sound, but it's all traffic and it was too loud. And cause I was r next to a busy road and I couldn't, I couldn't hear myself. I mean, you'll hear the traffic in the back, but I got a good minute and some change of video, and it's pretty cool. So this load that I'm going to show y'all, it is going from Knoxville, Tennessee, to El Paso, Texas. I have a new customer, or, yeah, customer, that I think I'm going to be working with from now on, and uh, he's out of El Paso, so he buys a lot of different uh, pieces, parts, vehicles, whatever, he buys a lot of different stuff and has it shipped to his place in El Paso, and he rebuilds it and stuff, and he resells, so he's always buying a lot of stuff everywhere, so, and... He's working with me or I'm working with each other on, you know, getting him the stuff that he buys. And the rates are good. I'm not going to say the rates because, like I said, like, like there's different situations. Like with this guy, he, um, I wouldn't say he posted loads on low board. Just that we have a mutual friend and he threw my name out there. My name out there. Hey, I know a guy that, you know, got hot shots and. You talk to him, you know, he might, you know, get you whatever you, whatever you buy, he'll bring it to you, because it was what he does, <clears throat> and we chit-chatted and all that, and I was like, well, let's, let's see how this works, you know, kind of being dedicated to this, to this one person, but, again, like I said, you no know, rates, rates are different with different people and situations, because you can find loads on low boards or whatever, but like I said, I had a mutual. We had a mutual friend. That's how I came about about these loads that I'm about to about to get. It wasn't that I went door to door knocking. Just we have a mutual friend, and like I said he mentioned me and was like, "Hey, you know, I want to use you, you know, to bring me the stuff that I buy." And like, well, give it a shot. You know, if the pay is really good, you know, it works out for me and for him. Then all right, we'll keep running. And like I said. <clears throat> I think I think this might be something, uh, I guess long term, but I'll be doing a lot of uh, loads for this, for this one guy. And uh, so this load that I got from Knoxville going to El Paso, it's uh, electric motors. I don't know what kind of motors they are. I, I think they go into like, uh, I think they go into like, compressors or commercial AC units I just I can't pinpoint right now I can't, I can't figure out and I didn't ask them but because it's I don't really care but they're electrical motors and when y'all see it you might have a better idea or y'all might know when when y'all if, if you know let me know but not that it matters but still it's just part of the job um yeah so it was seven pallets of electric motors and they all arranged in different weights. And I think so far, this might be the heaviest load I've had on on this trailer. It's like 8,000 pounds. 
but those the motors are heavy you'll see the video here in a minute again there's no sound other than the traffic in the background but those suckers are are heavy for being I mean that size is all it's all metal it's all steel I guess whatever but yeah and then I, I ended up tarping it so let me show y'all I mean the customer didn't want it tarped so I had to just bring it like that but I'm like nah man I'm gonna I'm gonna do you a favor a solid whatever and, and I'm gonna tarp it so let me show you how it looks like right now so here's the load tarped up um, you'll see in the video here in a minute of it being untarped at the, at the pickup but again it was seven pallet electric motors and it came out to um uh, what five six about 24 feet 23 feet i said it was just random not random pallet but they were like random sizes and and that's how i got it too because when i was told it was pallets four by fours and all that i figured you know i put two you know side by side whatever and i would have like 15 16 feet i could probably get another partial but this guy is paying me dedicated so I'm not gonna really look for a partial because he's got more stuff that needs to be picked up. So if I can drop this off quick, then I'll get onto my next pickup with this new customer. But yeah, he said to not tarp it, no big deal. But I was like, come on, dude, it's, it's electric motors and it's gonna rain from here to El Paso. And like, I, I know that he don't care or whatever, but I'm like, dude, I don't, I don't work like that. So I tarped it for him and, uh, but yeah, Knoxville to El Paso, so so yeah, there's this load, and like I said, this might be something dedicated that I might start doing if I see that the the money's right, good, when it works out and it makes sense. I just might just be a dedicated uh dedicated driver, but yeah, there's there's this load. Telling y'all, man, if you go out there, you hustle, or you start, you know, networking and all that, you might, like me, find this customer through a friend, you know, and, you know, you have to go out there and just network, you know, talk, and put yourself out there, you know. And again, I'm not going to do videos of every load that I do, but this one, I'm going to show you this load because it's pretty cool. So, let me show y'all this load. And again, there's no audio other than the traffic in the background. But again, it's seven pallets of uh, electric motors, and you'll see them, and you have a better, better uh, understanding what it is. All right, guys, let me uh, show you this video. Thank you. 